now. 95.9 FM WATD presents Friends with Benefits. Exploring relationships, social issues, and life stories. Be a part of the show at 781-837-4900. Friends with Benefits with your host, Brian Stratton. Ninety-five nine WATD friends with benefits here at the Red Parrot in Hall, right on Nantasket Beach, on a Thursday night here, nine o'clock start time. Friends with benefits every Wednesday and Thursday at nine. Shout out to the Longhorn Steakhouse uh, in Pembroke, and also to the Lodge on Route Twenty Eight in Randolph, our sponsors, and they uh, they keep things going. We're here at the Red Parrot, which is one of the best places right in the Hull Drag. Uh, it's here open uh, year. Around, oceanfront, two levels, beautiful. We have live music tonight. I got my buddy J.R. Mooney. J.R., how are you, bud? I'm doing good. How about yourself? I'm doing so good. It's good to see you, my friend. Now, you take care of all the riffraff around here, don't you? When it, yeah, unfortunately. They, they don't come in here, do they, when you're here? No, not when I'm here. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> J.R. is the, the gatekeeper here at the Red the red parrot here, and what a, what a tremendous summer it was here, JR. Huh? It's, it's been uh, absolutely awesome. Yeah, it's such a fun place to be, and um, in the winter time, it's 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 pretty. It holds its own pretty much, you know. Yeah, definitely. You, you get some locals, you get some people out of town, you get some good bands, some good food. It's a good time down here. It's it might be a little bit off the beaten path, but it's always worth it, don't you think? I think it's absolutely worth it. Absolutely. That's right. You come down here and say hi to JR Mooney when he's down here. He's the man with the beard, <laughs> you know, the, the good-looking bouncer. Let's put it that way. <laughs> We got my boy Ryan Stan- Stanton as an engineer. How you doing, Ryan? Great. How are you, Brian? Good. And we'd like to thank uh, Larry Nelson for being uh, uh, back at the headquarters at Broadcasting House. We got Bob Bandera coming up uh, as our first performer, live performer tonight. This is kind of special for me because I discovered Bob a couple years ago. He's a, a guy that's pro- probably about 50 years old, but been playing around. A, an incredible acoustic musician, a great friend, a great person. I collaborate with him. And uh, I just have a great time with this guy. Um, a lot of you might not know him, okay? He he's hasn't been out in the public as much. He's getting out there now. But you're going to know him because this guy is just great. So uh, why don't we, uh, why don't we uh, get why don't we get Bob on there? Bob, we are ready to go. Good evening, everybody. My name is Bob Bandera. And uh, we're at the Red Parrot here in Hull, down on the beach. And uh, I'm going to play a few songs for you, followed by some other very talented musicians. And uh, I'm going to start it off with a song written by uh, a friend of mine from a couple years back. So you probably won't know it. But it's a good song. I'm an early morning rider. That's the time I take to look around me It can only make me wiser As I go and grow, I know I've got horses to tend I've got fences to mend I've got letters to send And all to spend Don't you can't you see How simple it could be just set so free and ride away with me. I'm an early morning riser. That's the time I take to look around me. If I don't get any wiser, I don't mind because you see me. I've got horses to tend, I've got fences to mend, I've got and all you can see, no, you can't you see how simple it could be. Just set yourself free and ride away with me in the early morning sun. In the early morning sun, everything is true. The day is young. With an early morning smile, I can see all the sun. I've got horses to tend, I've got dancers to mend, I've got letters to send, and all to end. Oh, you, can't you see how simple it could be? Just set yourself free and ride away with me. I'm learning on in
Thanks very much. That song is called Early Morning Riser, and it was explained to me in a much different way than I thought it was talking about. But I'll never think of it the same. So, uh, this next song is a uh, Lyle Lovett song. He calls it a uh, cheating song about Mexican food. I, I don't know what that means. Well, I like cream in my coffee. I like to sleep late on Sunday. Nobody knows me like my baby. I like eggs over easy With flour tortilla and Nobody knows me Like my baby Nobody holds me Nobody knows me Nobody knows me like my baby But it was a dream made to order South of the border Nobody knows me Like my baby And she cried, man, oh how could you do it And I swore there were nothing to it Nobody knows me Like my baby well, I like cream in my coffee I hate to be alone on Sunday Nobody knows me Like my baby Thanks very much. So usually I play that song and then I just fizzle out all together. And, you know. <laughs> but uh, I, I think I'll play something a little quicker now. It's a, uh, it's a Paul Simon song from uh, quite a few years ago. He did this with Phoebe Snow. I remember her. Night was black, roads were icy, snow was falling, drifts were high. I was weary from my driving, so I stopped to rest for a while. Well, I sat down at a truck stop, I was thinking about my past. I've had a long streak of that bad luck And I pray it's gone at last Gone at last Gone at last Gone at last Gone at last, gone at last. I've had a long streak of that bad luck And I pray it's gone at last I ain't done I kicked around some No, I don't fall Too easily But that girl She looked so dejected She just grabbed my sympathy Sweet little soul Tell me what's your problem Tell me why I'm So downcast I've had a long Streak of that bad luck, pray it's gone at last, 
gone at last Gone at last Gone at last Gone at last I've had a long Streak of that bad luck It's gone at last Once in a while, in the middle of nowhere, when you don't expect it and you're unprepared, somebody will come and lift you higher, and your burden will be shared. Well, I do believe if I'd never met you, I might still be sinking fast. I've had a long home. Speaking of that bad luck, and I pray it's gone at last, gone at last, gone at last, gone at last, gone at last. Gone at last. I've had a long streak of that bad luck, and I pray it's gone at last. Thank you very much. Thanks very much. Uh, that's going to do it for my set. Please uh, stick around. Uh, we have Monk coming up next. And, uh, treat him as nicely as you treated me. <laughs> See you next time. 95.9 WATD, Friends with Benefits here. It was Bob Mandera doing his, his stuff. Sounding great, as always. Uh, an acoustical master at his craft. Great vocal too. Um, I was really impressed by him. He uh, he was really good. Just one of those guys that I feel like you can you know listen to, and he's just naturally good at singing. He's just uh, yeah. He, just doesn't, he doesn't have to try. He just does. Exactly. What, what did you think, Jr.? You you, you you digging his stuff? I thought it was unbelievable. It sounded really good. Yeah. Absolutely. Now this guy's got some experience behind his belt, and he's got he does a lot of that Americana folk. Uh, you know, older poppy stuff in the 70s and 80s and even 60s, but it just works for any crowd, you know, you know, and um, and he's uh, obviously schooled at what he does. We're going to talk to him in a couple minutes. He's just kind of putting down his stuff right now. But um, we have Monk coming up right after Bob, Bob du uh, Duani, who, by the way, is an area musician who plays, I mean, he plays a ton around this area. When I say a ton... I wouldn't be surprised if he plays 180 dates a year. He was here a week ago. Did you see him, Jr.? His I band, I he had a, a three-piece band. It was the night that was. I was told there was a wedding party that came in just maybe two weeks ago. Oh, the, yeah, the place he, was packed. Yeah, it was it's crazy. Awesome. It was crazy. So that was his band. So he's doing a solo thing now. We'll get Bob up here now. Bob is taking a sweet time over there. He's, he's folding his cord accordingly and placing his guitar ever so slightly. Here he comes. All right. And Monk's uh, putting his stuff together. Come on, Bob. Let me get Bob up here. Once again, we're at the Red Parrot in Hull, Nantasket Beach, right on the waterfront. Just a great place. Beautiful night tonight in the 60s. We have the doors open, the big glass doors. Come on, Bob, coming up. All right, ladies and gentlemen, Bob Bandera here. He's on Facebook if you want to find him. He's a Robert Bandera on Facebook. Is that right? That's Robert Bandera. That's correct. That's right. Tell us a little bit about where you're from, Bob. Well, I originally uh, came from uh, Dorchester, as a lot of people on the South Shore. Doesn't sound like with that voice. Oh, no. No, no, no. I've, JR I've, sounds more like Dorchester. I'd say so. Uh, I, I, can, I can do my Dorchester <laughs> stuff if you want. But, uh, no, thank you. No, no. I, no. That's what I said a long time ago. I stopped talking like that. Uh, he but, has a good uh, radio voice, doesn't he? He, re he really does. Wow. Well, that's, uh, Will you do a commercial for me sometime? Uh, absolutely. I'd be happy to. Yeah, I'll do one run right now. <laughs> Uh, no, so uh, uh, my wife and I live in uh, Marshfield now, and uh, another beautiful town by the sea, uh, like we are at uh, tonight. Just gorgeous. And, uh, I just want to say thanks to uh, Brian and uh, WATD for having me by tonight. It was. Well, what, what do you like to play, Bob? I mean, because I was just telling them you're the best, what, best kept secret around here. Well, that's true. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Even I don't know. Just, it. just <laughs> ask you. If you don't believe me, ask Bob. Uh, right. <laughs> well, I, I do a lot of, um, you know, like folk rock stuff is, is mostly me, acoustic rock. 
And, uh, you know, so I do a lot of James Taylor. Um, I, uh, I love Lyle Lovett, as, as you already know. We've attended a concert. We, uh, you and I attended. We, I think we were front row. Uh, we were front row. Right. Yeah, so. right. Well, it, it helps Lyle me to live next Lyle to Lyle wouldn't a, have uh, it any other way. No, by absolutely not. I'm, I'm surprised Lyle doesn't know me by face <laughs> by now. Oh, he does. Yeah, he, he does. does. Yeah. 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 Well, that would explain the security this. team does security. too. By the way. Yeah, I was just gonna say. <laughs> yeah, that's why I can't get on the bus for an autograph anymore. <laughs> so, so Bob, um, so I, I, what was that last one? Gone at last. That was gone at last. Was a song from uh, I think it's the early '70s. It's a uh, uh, Paul Simon and Phoebe Snow, the late, great Phoebe Snow. Now, Ryan, do you know who Phoebe Snow is? I know the name. This That's guy knows it. his stuff. He's right, a well. young buck, but he knows <laughs> all that historical 70s stuff. Well, it's it's good. It's a great song. I mean, uh, I, I remembered it years and years ago, and I think you and I were out playing one night somewhere. That's and I, right. And I just remembered it, and uh, I started playing it. And, and it became said, a staple it, in our uh, set. It, it really is. It it's really like is. I call it every time. It's like the well, first song I want to do. is. Well, that but, uh, you know, the good thing about it is you can play that song for half an hour, you know. I mean, it's, it's, oh, there's no it's question. just a three-chord blues. You just do the same thing over and over. It's fantastic. Well, so if you're running short of songs, that's the go-to song. You know? <laughs> you make that last half an hour. Where are you playing the next time? Do you have another gig coming uh, up? Yeah, as a matter of fact, I'm, I'm playing uh, mm -hmm. Sunday morning brunch at uh, the Jetty. In the Mar Jetty in Marshfield, right on Brent Rock. Right there. Ten to one. That's home Great of, place. Yeah, that's home of WATD, Marshfield, of course. Yep. We're, we're way off in the distance in Hull tonight, but yep. the Red Parrot. How do you like this room, the Red uh, Parrot? Well, you know, I'm going to show you how old I am. This place used to be known as Uncle Sam's to me. This wasn't it. Was this Uncle Sam's? This was Uncle that. Sam's. This was the disco Uncle Sam's. Like, now, that's that's heralded in the musical community because they had Aerosmith, Jay Giles. They, they had everybody. Yeah, there. they had lots of people here. I didn't know that. I didn't know this was Uncle Sam's. Well, it I used to be, when I was coming here, it was a big uh, disco thing. They had, they had the whole disco ball ceiling and the, the colored floor and everything like that. It wow. Was, oh, he's come here all the time. And now it's a red parrot, which we're, we're, we're engulfing uh, mucho amount of food, Ryan and I. Uh, calamari's great. The pizza's great. We're just going to get, get ready for Monk. Uh, let me wave Monk down see if he's ready. Do we have a we have a good signal for Monk? Yeah, I think he's playing with his loop. I don't know. It's all about Monk. Here we go. Hey, how you doing? My name is Monk Twain. Thanks for hanging out tonight. Thank you so much. Ah, oh, thank you. This is a song called Stupid Pride. You build yourself four walls out of 
nothing It's what the world calls a self-made man Caught mm -hmm. with your pants down while you're bluffing With your right hand milking your master plan Go and hide with your stupid pride Thank you so much. Thank you. Oh, we got to retune here, so hang on just one sec. So this next song is uh, a song about getting laid off. Not getting laid, getting laid off and uh, trying to pull yourself together. A song called 30 Days. Another episode that t would and plant my ass on the couch. Why can't I grab the remote and change the channel on my own self down? It took 30 days to force this from my head. I lack the definitive facts of what to do in the days ahead. Now I still brace myself against my ego on the man. And I never felt such way. It's buckling my frame. Can I do it? Definitive facts of what to do in the days ahead. It's been 30 days I've laid here in my bed. Each day is the same, but what remains when I'm hanging on by the thread? I'm hanging on now. I'm hanging on. I'm hanging Thank you. Oh. 
Sometimes you just can't fight Don't matter if you're wrong, if you're right You can bang your head up against a wall But you bleed and die before it falls No way to let it go Learn when it's time to fall your hands Some rivers never flow to the place we want to go Some rivers will divide Cut right through Right through you and I Do you believe in fate Or free will Not a life subjective Or subjected still Now you waiting on a sign Before you make a move but do you seize the day, establish your own groove? No, and let it go. Slow down on your approach or fight. Place we want to go. Some rivers will divide, cut right through you and I, cut right through. Some rivers will pull you down, 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 down. Place we want to go. Some rivers will divide, cut right through you and I, cut right through you and I. Some rivers, some rivers. Thank you so much. Next up is Phil Pacino. 95.9 WATD Friends of Benefits here Thursday night at Hull. Nantasket Beach at the Red Parrot. That was Monk Duani who did his special three song set. This guy plays all over the place. Ryan, I know you, lo you love his stuff. You love he, this guy. He's great. I've heard him uh, a few different places around the South Shore. Oh, you have? I have, actually. Um, and he's also been uh, featured on um, John Shea's show. As well, oh, he has? Famous. Okay. Yep. Um, so he's, he's, he's an incredible singer, and that was just a really great set, you know? He it's, belts it out. It, he really does. And he hits those notes that uh, sometimes are almost hard to listen to. But when they come out of him, it's not that difficult to listen to. That's right. You know, he, right. He's, he's talented, for sure. He's very talented and um, he plays all over the South Shore. Like I said, I think he's probably up to 180 dates a year um, and even Boston, North Shore, just kind of everywhere. So it's a great set by him. He's going to come up and talk to us for a minute and tell us where you can check out Monk. He's all around. Phil Pacino is going to be right after him too. Oh, wow. Another great name there. You know Phil pretty well. Yep. yep. He has a new um, song out uh, called Live It Down, which I, I heard. I like that a lot. Um, 
Hey, how you doing? Step on right up to the microphone. Thank you so much. Thank you. There it is. All right. Welcome to the Monk Hour. Thank you. Now, you're live on the air, so there's no swearing, okay? Okay, we will not do that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man, great set. Thank you so much. Those original tunes? Yes. Uh, good, good choice, man. That Thank you great very stuff. much. So, in your uh, solo performances, do you um, go between cover and original? Yes. I go between cover and original. I do a lot of loop stuff, so I, I set up rhythms just using the guitar as a cajon. And, uh, oh, really? Yeah. No kidding. Um, so, what kind of covers do you, uh, because I know those are all original, and... You know, to me, it was like a lot of Gavin DeGraw kind of oh, thank you. feeling in there for um, me. Is so, that, what did you get out of that, Ryan? A little bit of... No, I, I completely agree. Yeah. Actually, I was, I was very, uh, you know, surprised when he said that because it kind of is a good connection. You were trying to figure was, it out, weren't you? Yeah, I was, I was actually telling uh, Brian before you got over here, you hit some of the notes that sometimes are, you know, hard to listen to on the ears, but when they come out of you, it's it's not that hard to listen to. You can just... Anything that you belt out, it just sounds incredible. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you. Okay. So, yeah. I mean, I'm coming from like you know Bill Withers and and late oh, really? 60s, early 70s. I oh, mean, that's, sweet. That's my thing. So how can you not like that? Exactly. You can't go wrong with that kind yeah. of stuff. So um, do you have a, a full band? Full band. Yep. Uh, a lot of guys that play with uh, a lot of people around here. So you see these faces quite a bit. Um, in particular, uh, Jim Gambino from the Swinging Stakes. Very is well. Keyboard Piano. player. Yeah. yeah. Jim's a good buddy of mine. Jim's I love a great him. guy. Yeah. And, yep. Uh, Brockton's finest. He's he's my yeah. right hand man these days. So. Yep. Yeah. Jim is just a, a card. And so, um, what, do you have um, information like a website or Facebook or what? Absolutely. Uh, you can catch me on monkdwayne.com. That's M U N K D U A N E. Is it Dwayne? I've been -E saying Dwayne. Dwayne. Well, you can say can that, we if change you like that from South and Mason Dixon. It works. Sure. Can we change that because I think it does a little bit more roll, roll to the tongue. You want to? just sound a little bit more. Add important. that lilt to it, Dwayne. Yeah. Dwayne. Sure, Dwayne. Dwayne. Right. Yes. <laughs> you got to get in your lower <laughs> register for that, Dwayne. <laughs> um, or you can find me on. Uh, on Facebook, just go facebook.com slash Band. That's awesome, man. Thanks so much for being here. Oh, on my Friends pleasure. Thank you for having me. That was a blast. Thank you. And we got a, a great uh, Phil Pacino coming up here. My buddy. Doing yeah. his thing. Um, we'll, we'll get him. I, I don't know if he's situated yet. How's he look? Bar you ready to go? All right. We're going to let Phil <laughs> we'll take this one away. Back. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> you got it, man. Okay. Thank you to my good friend Monk and Bob for... Uh, Setting the pace. I'm Phil Pacino. Ladies and gentlemen of the radio and the internet. I'm going to play some original music for y'all. This is a song called Revenge. The girl's got daggers in her eyes. She says she's not, but she's surprised. When a legion of her friends Rising up to her pretend She's okay Boy's got silver on his tongue It's long before she's not the one And now an army's marching feet you want mine for you, love to see Leaves and far from okay Maybe it's time you stand And get a better love on baby Don't take his hand It only leaves you with one other Maybe sweet revenge There's what there's need Girl takes fragments of her soul She builds a force for you to feel whole Now her mother's on the phone Telling her she's not alone But she should pray Boy takes pieces of her heart He throws him carelessly like darts Well now his father's on the phone Wondering what the hell went wrong yesterday Maybe it's time you stand And get a better love on baby Don't take his hand And only leaves you with one other Maybe 
revenge was what is need. Six feet tall She tries not to regret her Or better yet not to forget her She don't care Maybe it's time to stand Get a little love on baby Don't take his hand Yeah, don't then leave you with one other Maybe sweet revenge All right, thank you, children of the Naked Oyster. All right, I, um, that was a song off my first record called Death by Lions. Well, the song is called Revenge. The album is Death by Lions. It came out two years ago. And I'm in the process of putting on a new record right now. And this is a single I released, which you can get off of my Nimbit page, N-I-M-B-I-T dot com. Look up my name, Phil Pacino, with an F. Pacino like Al. And this song's called Live It Down. And you can download it for free because, hey, music's free, right? Turn off the phone, cut the cord, don't let anybody in, at least not tonight. Tell yourself there's still time to change, but not too loud, it's far too strange. And if they hear you, they know that they were right. And they will never let you live it down. She just get wasted So we can laugh Instead of counting our mistakes You can see you You never have to face it Until those voices in your head Force you away Oh, it down
You walk the line as pressure builds, convince the seas of pain that kills as it lingers, slowly breaks it down. You tell yourself to be a man and hope in time you'll understand those reasons your life is spread out on the ground. And they'll pick you up and they'll help you live it down, down. We should just get wasted so we can laugh instead of counting our mistakes. Look and see you, you never have to face it. Until those voices in your head force you away. Oh, live it down. Can laugh instead of counting on stay. You can see you, you never have to face it. To those voices in your head force you away. Oh, live it down. Thank you. So this song goes out to, um, this is off my, f my, f my first record, Death by Lions. This song goes out to um, a very good friend of mine who just moved to Bora Bora. Crazy, who does that? <laughs> people do that, people, move, pe people relocate to Bora Bora. I might do it too. Join up. Have a cocktail on the beach in Bora Bora. Let's do it. It's a song called Afraid. I heard the light is gonna fall from the sky. So where to now? Where to now? She said she'd find the one that's burning inside. But I don't know how. I don't know how Mother's words echo On due time Everything will be fine But just keep in line Along the way Just be ready for what you find Don't lose your mind Don't lose your mind And I can feel the warmth on her face I can feel her heart start to race when I ask her why she stays in a cage She said it's nothing, she's just afraid Pulling out, but I don't know which way to drive Don't look back, don't you dare look back Wind blows through me, for a second I'm alive So serious, like a heart attack your father's words echo, don't you screw up your life Because it won't be fine unless you keep in line You better pray for what you're leaving behind Watch for the signs, both cruel and kind But I can feel the warmth on her face And I can feel her heart start to race when I ask who has to stay in a cage She said it's nothing, she's just afraid She said it's nothing, she's just afraid Whisper to me, run for your life. But 
beer to now With a hell to now She said I've lost the one that's burning inside But I don't know how I don't know how My brother's words echo From a cold lonely place He says take your time This both yours and mine Along the way I've always hoped that you'd find Something to fix that heart And ease your mind And I can feel the warmth on her face But I can feel the heart start to race When I ask why she stays in the key She's just afraid. She said it's nothing. She's just afraid. She said it's nothing. She's just afraid. She said it's nothing. She's just afraid. Thank you guys so much. I'm Phil. Come and come chat with me. All right, 95, 9 degree ATD friends with benefits here. We got JR in the house. JR, how you doing, buddy? Doing really good, man. He's, he's awesome. You like Phil, don't you? You and Richard, you guys. You guys he is just great. There's a little man crush going on with Richard. And him, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> uh, playing grab ass, I think, before the show. but Maybe a little bit. <laughs> wink, wink. Hey, we'll, we'll, come on, we'll, we'll bring you uh, right here. Phil Pacino here. Great set, Phil. Thank you. I, I bet those were all originals, right? They were. Excellent, man. Well, I appreciate you. Uh, you coming up and doing your thing tonight. Tell us, uh, where's the next time you're playing? Um, I'm actually playing tomorrow night at Stars in Hingham. Stars in Hingham. Oh, we've got a little loose connection. Is that all right? Is it coming through all right? Yeah, it's coming through fine. Okay, great. Uh, Stars in Hingham, right up the street. Right yep. up the street. Now, you play here at Hull quite a bit at this Red Parrot. I do. I love this place. Um, Richard and the and rest of the this place staff. loves you. <laughs> they do. The, the staff, the rolls. staff treats you like family. Well, they got free lobster rolls, so you yeah. really can't complain about free. I don't get free, free anything here. You, you know me? that, right? I'm, I just ordered um, 47 lobster rolls for everybody here. We're all <laughs> oh, well, I can't you. wait yeah. for. <laughs> Enjoy. We can't wait Enjoy. for ours to come. <laughs> <laughs> so, Phil, how do we get a hold of you on on, on the internet, uh, Facebook? Um, well, you know, everybody. Website. What do you do these days? I mean, everyone's on Facebook and Twitter and all that fun stuff. I have a website, Phil Pacino, F I L. F I L. Pacino like Al. Dot com. Dot com. But, I, you know, it's just such a hassle to update that. I should. There's no question about it. You know, it? It, that's why I don't Facebook work is so web easy. Websites. You, just, it's on, you know, you just log in and you just post something and then an argument ensues. And <laughs> 400 comments later, people are deleting and blocking you and, and the CIA is looking into your personal <laughs> business. It's, it's I notice there's a lot of time wasted on Facebook, going a lot of bantering back and forth with people. But you know what? It's, it's, it's very encompassing. It can... You can get sucked into that really easy, and then two hours later you look up and you're like, wait a minute, I've been here for two hours <laughs> arguing with this guy who lives in his basement. Yeah, in his parents' basement, which is not good. But, but anyways, we enjoyed your stuff. What's, what's your latest release called? Um, it's, it's a single called Live It Down. It's on a record that I'm working on right now that's going to be coming out um, hopefully in like late winter 2016. I'm recording it at 37 Foot Productions with um, the illustrious Sean McLaughlin um, at the board. Um, okay. Yeah. Is that uh, downloadable now, that song? Live that it song, down. Is, song is downloadable. It's going to be on iTunes, and it'll be on Spotify and all that fun stuff. But right now, I'm trying to keep it on my um, online store at nimbit, N-I-M-B-I-T dot com. Just search my name, F-I-L, Pacino like Al. And um, you can find my single. It's free. So download it because I'm giving you free stuff. And it's probably the only time I'm ever going to give you anything free. That's right. Right. Unless you buy us those lobster rolls, and that's free. Get, yeah, but you got to be here now to get the lobster rolls, so everybody out there listening right now, ha ha, no lobster rolls <laughs> Well, we you. got a good little Thursday crowd here. We do. I was it's really good. surprised. I mean, you know, it's, but, you know, Red Parrot and Hull right on the ocean front. You can't beat it uh, any time of the year. Everyone in the club, actually, we talked a little earlier. Brian, hope you join us. We're all going to go skinny dipping right across. I know it's yep. a little cold, but, you know. Well, you notice I'm not wearing pants, so I already got I the news. I did notice in I did get the news. It, you know, yeah. is it an issue? I don't know. It depends <laughs> on, you know, what your perspective well, you might have to worry about that more than I do. But anyways, uh, listen, Phil, it was nice to have you on the air tonight. Thank you for having me, my friend. Phil Pacino, Monk, and also Bob Bandera, who's sitting right behind us, uh, having a highball. Incredible. Yeah, I love you. And uh, Ryan Stanton, Tinker's son for Monk tomorrow night. Thursday night or Friday night? Friday night. 
Sorry, I'm what losing my What of the day. week is it? Well, it's Friday next, tomorrow. Where are you, Phil, tomorrow night? Anywhere? Stars and Ingham. Stars and Ingham. Still there. Okay. And um, I'll be at home. So anyways, guys, have a great night. You're listening to 95.9 WATD, Friends with Benefits.